First of all, congratulations on this film. It was by far one of the best films I've seen this year, and I was anticipating this for 10 years oh, and more. So yeah. thank you for an amazing film. Um, how did this process kind of start for both of you? Um, well, as far as the process of creating the, the movie, um, I think that we all knew we wanted to do something with Mike and Sally again. We love those characters, and we just wanted to see if there was an idea out there at all. And a uh, bunch of us got together, John Lasseter, Andrew Stanton, Pete Docter, the original director, and just talked about it for a while, and the idea of a prequel came up, the idea of going back in time and seeing how these guys met. And that really led to the possibility of college monsters, <laughs> which we loved. So I know that you did a lot of research and went to some colleges yourselves to kind of prepare for this. What was kind of the best story you have going to those colleges and bringing it into the movie? Um, you know, we, we took so much from the visits, uh, a lot, um, mostly that, uh, that college students are, are young, much younger, uh, much, much younger, <laughs> and, and a lot thinner and, uh, than we are. And uh, just in terms of the characters having to go back and, and, uh, and work on Mike and Sully and yeah. make them look college age. Um, so we focused a little bit on that, and uh, I mean, we brought some of the, the humor and just the, the, uh, the youthfulness, I think, of college campuses. Yeah, it was fun watching students, you know, playing frisbee and hacky sack, <laughs> and like, oh, how would a monster do that? Right. And even going to uh, fraternities, uh, fraternity rooms and yeah. dorms and yeah. things, was like, oh, this is really disgusting. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> dirty. Great. I remember this. Yeah. And that was easy to do in Monster World because, yes. you know, it's, supposed to be it's all gross. I know that you've been with Pixar for a long time, since almost the beginning. One of the things right. that I loved that I had heard that you guys did outside of the movie was you had your own scare games. Right. So tell me about right. your scare games. Uh, we, uh, you know, we just did it as kind of a, a, a bonding uh, stuff uh, on the team. And we got different departments on the film together to compete against one another. Uh, we played uh, dodgeball and we had all kinds of games. And, and it turned it, we, it was just going to be a one time thing. And then it was so much fun. And we had such a blast that then we started doing it like every month or every other month. Yeah, and we had like tricycle <laughs> races, tricycle races and uh, uh, I can't remember what else. We like did, mind game, like yeah, uh, totally brain teaser games. Brain teasers and everybody's uh, very competitive. <laughs> no, yeah, that's that's what we learned. <laughs> yeah, that uh, and they and they really thrive on that kind of competition and and they all got to know one another. So it was really really a great kind of teamwork thing to do. It's fun. This was your first feature as a director and your first as a lead producer. Mm -hmm. Why was Mike's story so important for you guys to tell? What I, I think we both liked about it was uh, it was kind of an original story to tell. Uh, so often movies are about uh, giving the message of if you work really hard, things will always work out. And that is a great message, but it's not always the case. And we loved the idea that we could tell a story for people like us, who had had failures in their lives that right. felt crushing at the time, uh, that led to better things. And yeah. so this felt like an opportunity to tell that story uh, of Mike. Um, yeah. yeah, yeah. It's a, it's a universal message. It's, it's really great. Because at some point in our lives, no matter whether we're, you know, what we're doing, you hit a wall. And, and you, and, but usually what's beyond that wall is something even better. And so it's, it's a great message, we think. It is a movie everyone needs to see. Thank you guys so much. It was amazing to sit down with you and I oh, hope everyone great. goes to see this film. Thank yes. you. Thank, Thank you. you. If you like this video, be sure to hit the thumbs up button and don't forget to subscribe to our AMC Movie News YouTube channel. It's free and we bring you all the latest movie news as well as our daily AMC Movie Talk Show. You can also follow us on Facebook and Twitter where you can find out about all the latest prizes, giveaways and special contests.